Here we are at Paladin Stadium between Ford Madison and Greenville Triumph. Mark Schoenz to Ross Devonport with you here on ESPN Plus. Week three. Likely matching what Madison have. Still missing Mohamed Say, Oliver Hald injured, as well as Carlos Anguiano Hassan Gabo on international duty with Somalia. But yeah, interesting. We talked about we talked to Matt, Matt about the the duel up top with Cheney and Galindras, and he's going with it here. It should give those back three from Greenville some trouble, perhaps. Yeah, sitting around 60 degrees right now, which is more than good enough to play some football in. And we are underway here. It's Ford Madison in the Greenville Triumph in week three. Our head official for today, Wes Cowett. That one finding Juan Galindres. Garner all the way off his line, clears that one away. And now Polak will push forward. Feeds it to Velasquez. Velasquez to Schultz. Schultz plays it back. Here's a winding shot straight into the arms of the keeper. With Herrera in the defensive midfield role, but hanging out 20 yards out there. Got caught that one well. Could... Let's see who provides the service. Players loading up at the top of the 18. It'll be Devin Boyce. Bounces in. Mel gets a shot off and it skips into the hands of Garner. Another look at it here. Yeah, Tyler Polak. You're doing great. Velasquez with the cross inside. Header on goal saved. Bart Shipman punches it over. He's trying to make it three straight games to start out the regular season. Superb delivery from Velasquez and you to put money on. Also doesn't make sense when you've got yards, you think you get him back 10 and they're only, clearly only back nine. That doesn't make any sense to me. Referee, use your yards lines to help you. Velasquez shoots. And that had some bite to it. Hammer into this Greenville squad. Now that was, looked like off the foot it was gonna. Multi-sport night in Greenville on the campus of Furman University. Maybe get some fans perched up at the top of the bleachers. You can get, get a little double game action. Look left, look right. I'm not sure what the layout is right around there. What the perfect seat for someone like that would be. Gebhard keeping it in play. Gebhard plays it back to Cheney. It's off target. But Christian Cheney couldn't put it on target. Yeah, Garner committed, got caught in no man's land. Velasquez stepping. Trying to feed to Castro. It's back to Velasquez. Castro out to Herrera. Chilaka knocking over Velasquez. It's going to be a penalty, I think. The ref pointing over to the spot. Castro with two hands on his hips. Very slowly, and it's saved. Shipman dives on it. Maybe a bit too much wind up from the veteran striker. Denying entry from the spot. Beautiful save that penalty against Aaron Walker last season. That turned into a goal going the other way. This time he holds on to it. In the one nil victory for Greenville back in July when he scored against him. Can Madison find something here? Boyce with the service inside. Galindra is trying to sneak it. You know, he can contort his body in any which way and put a ball on goal. Doing a good job of annoying Christian Garner. Velasquez. Trying to play it forward, and that'll roll out of bounds, and you would think that's where the whistle will blow. And right on cue, 45 plus have transpired here at Paladin Stadium. But no goal between these two sides, despite a late penalty attempt for the Greenville Triumph. Gebhard couldn't get by Tyler Pollock. Evan, Evan Lee, Lee. <laughs> splitting defenders. Castro sitting right in front of the goalkeeper, Burnt Shipman. Hey, Madison with the sort of four zonal markers inside the six-yard box and 
The rest of them picking up runners. Smith gets contact on it. Schultz tees it back in place. And Fricky almost with the finishing touch. But Bart Shipman was on top of it. Yeah, Fricky just we didn't react quite quick enough. It was a lovely header in by Smith and the flick by Castro. Fricky inches from poking that one past Shipman for a 1-0 lead. That's going to be a yellow card on Tyler Pollock. He came crashing in. Inventive there. Here's Devin Boyce once again. Has the cross. Floating in and clutching it is Garner. Just like that first game, Garner's been solid. Not spectacular. He's done what he needed to do tonight. No real big saves, and that'll do it. With the final whistle blowing, Greenville and Madison sticking true to the old values of this matchup. Nil-nil your scoreline between these two founding clubs.